But when I did the Breakfast Club with Daniel, everybody was mad, but everything Dang changed. Dash. It became That's independence. On the math off of so show. when I was being obnoxious and waking people up about independence, they were like, oh shit, you talking about math? Up? And they thought that shit was cool. And now it's not cool. Mm. I changed the game. Mm. You have to be disruptive to change the game. Mm. You cannot change the game. You can't take a block being nice. So your approach is You know what I said? You can't take a block You can't nice. go to war being nice. The people that are hurting... Yo, man, I agree with what Dame Dash is saying, man. If you're trying to take over, man, if you're trying to do your thing, man, and you want to build a name for yourself, man, you cannot do it being nice, man. You have to show some type of assertion, bro. You got to show that you demand what you want. Now, a lot of people don't really care for Dame Dash because of the whole pick a side between... Jay-Z and Dame Dash, right? But this is what I got to say, man. I think without Dame Dash, there would be no Jay-Z. That's just a fact in my eyes. I think Dame Dash mindset got Jay-Z to where he got Jay-Z to a point to where he could flourish. And once Jay-Z realized he didn't need Dame anymore, he just went on his way and got the bigger bag. And Dame feels slighted about that. And he's going to speak about it right here. Y'all pay attention. Are the people that need to be hurt. Right now. None of my homeboys is hurting with me. Listen. You ain't hear no disrespect. We still cool. It's been 20. This man used to work at Rockwood with me t 20 years ago. Anybody you know that knew me years ago, they don't use Kim or Rosario. I knew her in college, Columbia College. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? We still cool. So if I'm not cool with you, that means you a sucker. I met you. Well, yo, right there. Y'all know he talking about no other than Jay-Z, yo, he calling Jay-Z a sucker, man. What did Jay-Z do, man? Dame saying that Jay-Z basically did a backdoor deal, sold the company, and basically ran off with, with the money, basically. Like, Jay-Z sold out what the plan was. The plan was never to do what Jay-Z did. Jay-Z took another path. Dame was on the path of independence. Jay-Z was on the path of getting a bigger bag. Now, we all know that if you're independent, it's a slower grind to get the bag. Eventually, you, eventually you'll get there, but there's a road, there's a long journey that you have to take to get there. Jay-Z seen it in another way, two separate ways to get the bag. Now, there's nothing wrong with either way, but Dame is basically saying that the plan was never the way Jay-Z chose, and Jay-Z basically backdoored him and he took the bag another way. <laughs> if, you, if I'm not cool with you, that means you are hurt. The, the people that are offended need to be offended. My, my intention is to offend those that have, 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 have stopped the evolution of our culture. I want them uncomfortable. Our culture. Yes, our culture. Again, clarify our culture. You don't people just that have been oppressed. No, hip hop, Definitely black people, first and foremost, because I'm black. All right, man, so there y'all have it, man. What do y'all think about what Dame Dash had to say about Jay-Z? I think Dame Dash is one of the greatest minds to run the music industry, man. That's what I believe. Um, I know Jay-Z is very successful, but I think Dame Dash is, uh, his pride holds him back in life, and Jay-Z don't really carry the pride that Dame had. So that's where the fallout is. It's the pride thing. Dame Dash has way too much pride. As a man, and Jay-Z was like, yo, man, we got to do this to get to where we got to get to. We're going to shake these hands. And Dame didn't want to shake the hands. Dame just wanted to just basically diss everybody. And now, you know what I'm saying? We seen how the story ends. But I want y'all to drop a comment, man. Make sure y'all like this video. Subscribe to my channel. It's your boy Busy. I'm gone.